There's a famous story in the book of Luke that for centuries has been known as the parable of the prodigal son. It's a story about a son who takes his father's inheritance, wastes it all, and then returns to a forgiving father. But it is a great mistake to think that this is a story about just one son. It's actually a tale of two sons. It's a story about a younger brother and an elder brother. We are meant to compare and contrast them. And if we don't compare and contrast them, we miss the radical message that Jesus is leading us to. He also wants us to see ourselves in the story. He wants us to see that we need something that's missing in our lives. He wants us to long for something. He wants us to seek something. He wants us to hope for home. Jesus' purpose in telling this parable was not to give us a sentimental message. He is here to say basically this, that everything you've ever heard and everything you've ever thought about how to approach God is wrong. This parable will help us live out the implications of what it means to be gospel-transformed people. Not elder brothers, not younger brothers, but people living as images of our true elder brother, Jesus Christ.